yeah, when it comes to like flat pack or app, um, oh geez, what's the other one? Snap, of course, and then uh, app image. A lot of those are like containerized programs. I can appreciate when you'd use them, and it can be a really good thing when you are using them because, um, you don't really have to have to worry about your system breaking because you're never really messing with dependencies or your actual root root thing. So. I appreciate the the idea of flat pack and app app image and, and snap. The idea is sound and I think it's a good thing if they're performant enough. It's just not every package would be suitable for that, especially like system wide packages that you're using a lot and it's interfacing. Like if it's something like a game, that makes a lot of sense actually, especially if you can make it just as performant as installing because then it's kind of like in its own little bundle, which is nice. But if it's something that's kind of like all over the system and sprinkled everywhere, you don't really want that as a flat pack, you know? It just depends on how isolated the program is. If it's really isolated, a great example of a flat pack I do at every system build, even arch systems, right? You can build pretty much anything. Anybody can build an arch. It's, it's uh, the fact that I don't want Discord having access to the rest of the system so i can set up a flat pack discord and then i don't have to worry about you know tencent and china snooping on me <laughs> so it is a great uh great program that you want isolated so there's a lot of programs you do want to separate it from your system files so it's not really a either or situation it's more of a use the right tool for the right job kind of situation there's times where flat pack makes sense like installing Discord, and times when it doesn't make sense, like NeoVim, for instance. I don't find that. It's something I, like, want everywhere. If I'm in console or, you know, uh, wherever I'm at, I want NeoVim. So I, I don't really want to use a flat pack for that. So that's kind of kind of my thought process on when you use flat pack and app armor or app image, and when you would use, like, a maybe build from source or maybe a system package using your package manager. Uh, there's certain times where one makes more sense and other times where this other way makes a lot more sense too. So don't always think that one's superior to the other. It just depends on the situation.